page 15. Nina and the baby sparrows. There was great joy in Nina's house. Nina's aunt was getting married. Nina, her father, mother and little brother were all going to Delhi for a wedding. Everyone was happy except Nina. Her mother took her to the market to buy a new dress. What colour would you like? Mother asked. I don't want a new dress, mother, said Nina. Um, salwar kameez then? Nina shook her head. Mm -hmm. Um, what about those lovely white shoes you saw last week? Mm, I don't want those either. Thank you, mother. Nina's mother was upset. But she said nothing. They went back home and had lunch. After lunch, mother came and sat near Nina. What is it, child? She asked. Why did you say no to everything? Page 16 Mother, I don't want to go to the wedding. But why? Nina said nothing. Instead, two big tears rolled down her cheeks. Mother put her arms around Nina. Oh, don't cry, my pet. She said. Why don't you tell me what's bothering you? More tears rolled down Nina's cheeks. <laughs> Mother! She said, There's a sparrow's nest on the bookshelf in my room and there are two baby sparrows in the nest. I see, said Mother. <laughs> They are just beginning to get their feathers and growing up makes them so hungry. All day long they cry, cheep, cheep, asking for food. I see, said mother. If we go, the whole place will be locked and how will Papa and Mama Sparrows feed their babies? <sighs> Oh, Nina, cried mother, giving her a big hug. Oh, uh, is that why you don't want to go to the wedding? But that's no problem at all. We leave the window open. Oh, can we, mother? Can we? Really? <laughs> yes, yes. We'll remove all your things from the room and lock the door on the outside. So the house will be perfectly safe and Papa and Mama Sparrows can come and go freely too. Just think, Nina, while you enjoy yourself at the wedding, the baby sparrows will be getting nice and fat in their nest. Good idea, isn't it? It was a good idea. When Nina came back from the wedding, there were two plum little sparrows flying all over the room. And wasn't Nina thrilled? Pratibha Nath New words Market Bother Problem Dress Upset Remove Wedding. Lovely. Plump. Reading is fun. 1. Why was there great joy in Nina's house? 2. Why was Nina worried? 3. What did mother suggest? 4. What did Nina find 
when she came back from the wedding. Page eighteen. Talk time. One. How do baby sparrows eat? Two. What new things would you like to wear for a wedding? You can say, "I would like to wear." I would also like to wear dash. Picture story. Number the jumbled picture story correctly. Then write the story in proper order. Mother says, "We will leave the window open." Nina is happy again. Nina is sad. Nina does not want to leave the baby sparrows alone. Mother asks why. Page nineteen. Write the story here. One, dash, two, dash, three, dash, four, dash, five, dash. Team time. Would you like to have birds visiting you every day? Try making a bird bath and a feeding corner for birds. You can place a bowl of water in a quiet corner of the school playground. Leave breadcrumbs, grains, etc., for your feathered friends. Let's draw and color a bird. Page twenty. Activity. Let's make a bird. Things you need. Old greeting card. Dal. Black bindi. Beads for eyes. Scissors. Gum. Old newspaper. Old shoe lace. Steps. One. Make an outline of the bird on a greeting card, and cut it out. Two. Cut a small square from an old newspaper and fold it to make a fan. Keep the fan closed. Three. Pass the folded fan through the cut on the bird's back. And now, open the folds of the fan. Four. Make the eye by sticking a bindi. Five. Paste a string or old shoelace to hang the bird. Page twenty-one. Word building. Write down suitable words describing each picture. Pick up the words from the list given below. Beautiful, black, red, happy, tall, fat, a dash, woman, a dash, rose, a dash, boy, a dash, peacock. A dash boat. A dash man. Now describe these pictures in your own language. Say aloud. Spoil. Sport. Sparrow. Speak. School. Scout. Skirt. Skip. Scold. Skin.